Alrighty, you guys, so we are going to start today's video off with a nightly routine. Um, and so in this nightly routine, what we're going to do is I'm going to show you guys how I do kind of like my own twist on a meatloaf recipe. Now, I'm going to give you guys a little background. I am not a meatloaf person. When I got married to my husband, he kind of introduced me to how, you know, the kind of foods that he likes. I'm more of a southern girl. That's all my mother cooked in our household. So that's kind of like all I know is southern food. Um, but he also showed me some different things, some different foods that he cooked and that he's used to. So I started to learn how to make meatloaf and my sister-in-law really showed me how to make a really good meatloaf and she does a really good job. She's an amazing cook. So I'm going to show you guys how I do my meatloaf recipe, but I'm also going to add a little different twist to it. So instead of using ketchup, I'm going to be using barbecue sauce for my topping. Um, I'm not a big ketchup person and I don't think anybody in my family really cares for it too much. So I am going to do more of a barbecue topping and it comes out so so good And then I'm also going to show you guys how I do carrots and then cabbage for the side We are working on really trying to change our lifestyle and our health routine And we're really trying to get some weight loss in I know meatloaf is not really the best thing as far as a weight loss journey But this is a dinner that we just had and we were like, you know what, let's just use this meat And so this is what we're doing with it um, But we are dedicated to really Really changing our bodies and our eating habits so you'll see a lot of my meals be more heavy on the greens rather than a starch side you guys for this meatloaf I would definitely be adding the recipe in my description um, what what I did I did not show is I did put two eggs in there I did add some brown sugar along with the seasoning to give it a little bit more flavor and of course I did add some more water in the uh, cabbage and also to my meatloaf for the gravy so when it all comes together it's very flavorful and rich so you guys definitely check out the recipe in my description I will make sure I link that below Okay, you guys, so this is what my dinner ended up coming out like. I'm going to tell you, it was so, so good. Um, my husband was just like going on and on and on and on about how good the dinner came out. And it actually came out very, very good. Okay, you guys, so this was Leia's first Christmas tree in her room. I was really excited about getting this because I could not wait. We were going to put up a big white tree in her room, but that one actually did not work out. And I'm kind of glad I didn't because it would have been way too big. Um, but I got this tree from Target. It was about $16. Um, I did kind of feel like it was a little pricey for a little tiny tree, but it, it worked out so well. I mean, I like it in her room. I think it's adorable. And she was really excited about decorating it with her new Christmas bulbs those are unicorn bulbs and I got those from um, Big Lots for six dollars so I couldn't resist and then I have some purple bulbs that I um, bought a while ago and never really used it so that's something else that we put on the tree and it came out so cute she was really excited about decorating with me and it was a great time um, spending with her to do it so we had a great time and you guys she was so tired she kept rubbing her eyes but she wanted to stay awake so bad to put up her Christmas tree so she was really really tired in this video um, but after we do the Christmas tree we put her to bed and she does her little nightly routine she says her prayers at night and then she she gets in her bed um, so you guys she was really tired but she stuck it out and she got her Christmas tree done so I'm really excited for her with her new tree in her room
Okay, can you say your prayers? Don't get distracted. It's time to go to bed now. We need to put our prayers on again. We we did our prayers already. We need to do it again. No, uh, -uh. I don't want to do it again. Yes. Jesus knows I love him. He said, I said good night. Come on. I love for grandma. Okay. I love for papa. I love her mom. I love, I love you too. What about daddy? You love daddy? We love you, of course. We love Daddy. This Christmas, let the others miss us. Okay, you guys, so we are in the family room, and I am starting my decorations on this Christmas tree. So we had this Christmas tree for about two years. Um, we had it in our apartment, and now we are having it in our new home. Really exciting to say that. And I thought this would be a great look to have more of a traditional look downstairs. So I still kept with the same silver and gold and a little pop of red accents. You guys, as the time and the years go by, I definitely will have some greater decor, some fun stuff. But for right now, this is what we got and I'm really excited. It's a great kind of um, area and space for the kids, um, for Leia and her cousins when they do come over. Um, hopefully, you know, after quarantine and everything and COVID, we're able to kind of just just have a little bit more family and friends but this is something that you know she loved and adored so it was kind of cool having her see all the Christmas trees and she's actually in the year of noticing everything and you know talking more about Christmas and what she wants for Christmas very opinionated on that one but it's good she's exercising her voice <laughs> um, so you guys I just did this space in more of a traditional way I did kind of do like a little fire thing well I actually didn't have a fireplace but I put up some stockings and and, um, a little decor so I did get some lanterns from Walmart and um, I did put a little bit of garland and some stockings up I will be updating my stockings next year not this year um, but yeah so this downstairs area kind of gave me more of that traditional feel very comforting very cozy and warm inviting um, feel this is kind of like our family room where we go downstairs and watch movies lay it calls it her slumber party kind of um space where she likes to every friday come downstairs do popcorn and we do a movie and that is like her thing every single friday so this is what we do and it was fun to have the christmas tree up and really be able to enjoy that together so i hope you guys enjoy this part um this is just putting up the tree and just really um decorating this area TV or phone Is it wrong for me to want you for my own This Christmas Let the others miss us Let's go get snow
the city There are people everywhere The snow is falling white and pretty As I stroll on my way Go get snowed in